This is James Hurdle for IPL TV in association with Matkins Gym. Our bow. We're in Sheffield today. We've now got the golden kid, Carl Yusuf. The golden kid. How are you, Carl? I'm all right. How are you? I'm all right. I'm all right. You made your IFL TV debut the other day with Tyanne Booth. First yeah. time we're getting you on the channel. How, how was that experience for you? Um, the experience was well, you know. You know, coming in, in front of a camera now, you know, it's, it, I'm used to it now. So, you know, with Tyanne, obviously, he's from gym. He's from my gym. So, you know, it was just cool. Just laid back. A good, it was a good interview. Yeah. What do you make of Tyan's sort of style as an interviewer? You know, I feel I feel really comfortable around him. You know, you know, because obviously I've been in gym with him for a re very long time. But maybe with others, they might not seem that confident. But with me, I'm fine. I'm fine with Tyan. <laughs> Talk to me a little bit about Carl Yusuf. We got a little well, bit of information uh, from the interview with Tyan. But tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, you know, um, I'm 22 years old. I'm a flyweight. Um, you know, there's not many flyweights out there, but you know, I've made a bit of a name for myself, you know, with that knockout last week. <laughs> so, you know, whoever's been, whoever's watching, you know, I'm telling you now, look out for me, you know, because I'll be a big problem for everyone. Now, there is one flyweight I want to talk to you a little bit about. He's self became the name in the flyweight division at the moment. <laughs> I want to talk to you a little bit about Prince Patel. Yeah. What are your thoughts on the Prince? What are my thoughts? Um, to be honest, you know what? I enjoy watching him. You know, he's, he's, he's not he's not he's not a bad character. Um, you know, he's doing well. You know, look, like he says, he gets the views. People come to watch him, whether they come to see him lose or not. He's still getting people to come watch him. So, you know, I, I'm not gonna say anything bad about him, but I'm telling you now, there's only there's only one one fighter out there that's gonna be a problem for everyone. And soon, give it a couple of more fights. I'll be ready to take everyone on. Huh? Prince Patel's had two fights. He fights on Saturday in Harrow in his first professional contest. How many have you had so far? I've had five now. You've had five, five. professional. Yeah, stuck two. But okay. you know, like with I've it not being such a big division in depth in terms of numbers, do you, do you think yourself and Prince Patel could meet in the future? Um, yeah, hundred percent. Because there's not many fighters, so I think soon once we've had that, like once Prince Patel's had so many fights, once a few others have, I've gone. I know hundred percent we're all going to meet. Mm -hmm. We're going to have to meet because obviously uh, we, all, we all want to be top dog, don't we? You had a few choice words for Waleed Din as well. Uh, Waleed Din, you know what? Waleed Din's a very good fighter. And obviously after my fight, I quickly showed up and uh, sat down. Obviously, I couldn't wait to watch him. And you know what? To be honest, I thought you were going to win the fight, but maybe the kid was a little bit too strong. But Thomas Osamo, he looked like a beast at flyweight. He, like he did look beast. like a beast, but I don't know. I, I, so, at times, I think Walid was just trying to fight with him a bit too much. I think if he tried boxing him a little bit more, I think he would have done him. But, you know, I think Walid will come back from that. Mm -hmm. And, you know, because he's a very good fighter, he's very skillful. So, you know, all the best to Walid. All right. When are you out next, Carl? What's the plan? Uh, the plan is I should be out December sometime. So, you know. Before Christmas, sorry. Yeah, 100% before Christmas. You know, it'll be my sixth fight. You know, I need to end it with a. I need to end it quicker than that first round knockout. So, you know, if I can get it in within the first minute this time, you know, that'll be that'll be a bonus. So, you know, everyone, when I when I do get a fight day, you know, I let everyone know. And you know what? Trust me, you need to watch me. I'm telling you now. <laughs> you heard it here first, yeah. Carl Yusuf. Thank you for giving our full team your time. We look forward thank to seeing you next time. Nice, nice, nice one, mate. Thank you, mate.